Hello and welcome to our channel. Now this video will tell you how the cast of the Adams Family 1964 has changed. I'll show you what they looked like back then in 1964 and now in 2022 how they changed compared to when they were in this movie. Alright, let's go. Carolyn Jones in the film she plays Morticia Adams. A beautiful and educated woman needing, passionate about art. In 1964, she was 34 years old, and it was with great sadness that she passed away on August 3rd, 1983, at the age of 53. My poor little hemlock. Where have I failed you? I know. You haven't been getting enough moonlight. And for an actor, that's pretty peculiar, yes. let me tell you. So I think he would be more interested in his intellect yeah, and think, think and think he, his intellect is more attractive than himself. John Astin in the film he plays Gomez Adams, a retired lawyer. Gomez is of Castilian origin. He considers Spain as his homeland. In 1964, he was 34 years old and now he's 92 years old. We have our own board of education. Mama tutors the children in all the fine arts, music, painting, ballet. She's the long hair of the family and a fantastic dart player. I thought that would work better. And it turns out comedy. that's one of the strongest, that's one of the strongest elements in the show is the Gomez-Morticia relationship. Yeah. Ted Cassidy in the movie he plays Lurch, Adam's lawyer butler, who mostly speaks in grunts or groans. In 1964, he was 32 years old, and it was with great sadness that he passed away on January 16, 1979, at the age of 46. Well, couldn't I just stay here? I'm sure you and I can settle this matter. <laughs> on the other hand, perhaps it would be better to see Mr. Adams. Follow me. Sundance, when we're done, if he's dead, you're welcome to stay. Jackie Coogan in the movie he plays Uncle Fester, Morticia Pompous Uncle, who is completely bald and usually wears a dark coat or coat with a large fur collar. In 1964, he was 50 years old, and it was with great sadness that Coogan died of heart failure on March 1st, 1984, at the age of 69. I can even make it blink! <laughs> uh, I saw it by my eye. He was a marvelous storyteller, narrator. Lisa Loring in the movie she plays Wednesday Adams, Gomez and Morticia's daughter, the youngest member of the family. In 1964, she was 6 years old, and now she's 64 years old. It's Marie Antoinette. Grandmama told us about the French Revolution, and Paxley chopped off her head. In Puerto Vallarta, Mexico. And this is her first autograph show. She's, she's never done one before, and she was really sweet. I liked her. Felix Stiller in the movie he plays Cousin It, Gomez's cousin. It's a completely small character with floor-length hair, a watermelon hat, and sunglasses. In 1965, he was 28 years old, and it was with great sadness that Felix Stiller passed away on April 16, 2021 from pancreatic cancer at the age of 84. Over all night free market signing autographs with the some of my friends from the Adams family. And, uh, so I don't know if you have some questions. I don't even ask me. Ken Weatherwax in the movie he plays Puckley Adam, Gomez and Morticia's son and Wednesday brother. In 1964, he was nine years old and it was with great sadness that Weather Wax passed away on December 7, 2014, of a heart attack at the age of 59. Wednesday! Here, I fixed it for you. No, actually, uh, once they shaved my head and put me in, in uh, OD green, I looked just like every other cadet that was there, so I didn't have a problem with the recognition while I was in the service. Vito Scotti in the film he plays Sam Picasso, a skimming Spanish artist whose family members rely on for artistic advice. In 1964, he was 46 years old, and it was with great sadness that Scotty died of lung cancer on June 5, 1996, at the age of 78. 
May I offer you a cigar? Here. Have one. <laughs> I will see for later. Let's join the conversation. If you think you found a scintillating breakfast companion, sir, I say you have found me at my worst. and you a rebate. <laughs> Great Scott, look at the time. I'm going to be late for that cornerstone ceremony. Oh, do forgive me. Do forgive me. Goodbye. Him, you know, the, a woman's power is really great. Clint could be a little waspish. Um, the the uh, TV spots. Blossom Rock in the movie, she plays Grandmama, Gomez's mother a witch who cast spells and divination with the crystal ball and throw knives. In 1964, she was 69 years old, and it was with great sadness that Blossom Rock passed away at the age of 82 on January 14, 1978. Room. <laughs> that was close. Go ahead, Pastor, get another shot. Eddie Cullen in the movie he plays Clyde Arbogast an insurance agent working for Arthur Hansen. In 1964, he was 57 years old, and it was with great sadness that Quillen died of cancer on July 19, 1990, at the age of 83. Quick, Your Honor, it's that Adams family. They've been here twice. I'll stall them until you can duck down the fire skate. <laughs> Cut out the melodramatics, Clyde. They're voters, aren't they? Well, anything is possible. Thanks for watching the whole video. If you like this video, please share it, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel to support us in producing the next video.